How's it going guys? My name is Top Secret R35 and welcome back to another episode of GTA Online. So I bought this Avenger, I don't know, a couple of months ago. I bought it when it wasn't on discount. I thought that I could transport like personal vehicles in it, but it turns out you can only do weaponized vehicles. So I wanted to do like a stunt with it, as in uh, drop like a car from the I don't know, the top of nowhere onto Mount Chiliad and like do like a crazy, I don't know, some Gymkhana style mad stunt. So I bought this Dune FAV that you can see over there. So we're going to modify it and then we're going to try to make the stunt happen. So the thing is already, I kind of know that this is more than likely not as cool as I'm making it sound. It's probably going to turn out to be very lame, but I do just want to hopefully, hopefully, hopefully you guys saw like a sick looking thumbnail. And if that's the case, then I've succeeded pretty much. You know, I just want to have like an action packed thumbnail. Jesus, think can't even do burnouts. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> so this thing, I mean, it looks cool. It looks like a like a cheap version of the ramp car pretty much. And while I'm standing still, I can move across and use this turret thing. So, I mean, that's pretty nice. Shoot, shoot, come on. What's going on here? Ah, there we go. Okay, so you actually have to use accelerate to shoot. I swear, man, every single vehicle, it's different. Oh, so let's see what modifications we can do here, considering we have all of them unlocked. All right, so I'll go ahead. We'll do the armor since I'm going to be dropping this thing out of a plane. All right, so technically, I shouldn't be lowering this since I need all the suspension travel I can find. We'll do race transmission. We'll put a turbo on. All right, cool. Weapons. This is what I was interested in. Okay, so we can put a... Oh, wow. We can change that to a grenade launcher or to a massive minigun. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Now, it just sucks that I can't use that. I have to let somebody else use it or I have to bring the car to a complete stop. Yeah, I'm not too worried. Let's just put these dukes on. That looks kind of cool. And I'll put some stickers on the tires or some lettering. That looks nice. Bulletproof? Yeah, why not? In case somebody tries to come at us. All right, so that is it. Kind of lame, but that's okay. So now we'll exit the vehicle and let's go fly this Avenger and go try. Hey, don't call me. And we'll try to do the stunt that I want to do. I still cannot believe that this flippin' thing exists in real life. It's called the B-22 Osprey, I believe. You guys should check that out. I mean, this is the pinnacle of engineering. And psh, and we'll start going forwards. And I should have bought this Avenger when it was on discount because it is awesome, but it's also a really, really expensive, especially when you start adding all the modifications to it. All right, so here's the deal. I'm gonna fly to the top of Mount Chiliad. Then I'm gonna look for like the steepest embankment, right? We're going to go above that, vertically, like completely above it. Change to, uh, what's the word? Autopilot. And then uh, ramp down and race all the way down. Like, uh, I don't know, you guys ever play Forza Horizon 3? That's coming to end of life, by the way. Rest in peace, Forza Horizon 3. But there's a, a Blizzard Mountain, the expansion. You drop off the top of the mountain in like Ken Block's forward focus thing above. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. All right, well, here we are. I think we should have went into... Autopilot by now, whoops. Oh man, I'm kind of nervous. I mean, this is really stupid, but still, I want it to look sort of believable. All right, guys, moment of truth. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Woo, I'm falling, I'm falling, I'm falling. Okay, not perfect, but... Oh, <laughs> man. I guess it, it kind of works, it kind of works. Wow. <laughs> Okay, I think, uh, you know, it, it, I'm not going to try to lie now and say that was cool. I kind of failed. Oh, I was trying to park at like more of an incline somewhere, you know? Or try to land at an incline and then just start driving type of thing. So if I'd land like this, that would have been a success. Whee! Oh well, screw you train. Alright, so here's the plan. I think this is going to work a bit better. I'm going to try to line myself up, like right next to this cable car here. And it's impossible for me to not hit this embankment over here. I think the first time was a bit too high and had no real sense of direction of where I was going. Okay, here we go. Perfect. I think it's perfect. I'm going to land right over there. Okay, let's do it. Alright guys, hopefully this works better. A little bit better. Oh yeah, oh yeah! This is action backed. Oh, this is perfect! <laughs> oh, oh, oh goodness! Oh goodness! That was awesome. That was awesome. Okay, the, the ending was a bit a bit bad. But I'm still going. I'm still going. Just don't get stuck. Don't blow up. 
we consider this a success. Come on, come on, keep it together. Oh man, this is awesome. This is uh, BJ Baldwin. <laughs> now it would be much more freaking cool if I could actually take the trophy truck or something like that, but since you're not allowed to put personal vehicles inside the Avenger, it's just lame as hell. Woohoo! Woo! A little bit of a stunt jump. Well guys, I guess at the end of the day, I had a feeling that was going to be kind of lame, but uh, at least I put my mind to it and I got it done. <laughs> I just had the itch to jump out the Avenger and land on Mount Chiliad. It sounded really cool at the time. <laughs> well, otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed the little stunt video here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.